Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel from Corelust, and today it is Product Thursday. And I wanted to give you guys a quick tip on one of my products that I use starting out in the reefing hobby, and it was Carib Seas Purple Up. I don't know why this was the most amazing product for me. I was using a regular salt, I think it was like Marine Crystals Reef Salt back then. I had a mixed reef, and I was just doing water changes, and I had a hang on the back filtration, and my reef tank was a 55 gallon, and all I was using was this purple up, and I had amazing, amazing results. So back then I really wasn't water testing. Um, they didn't have the equipment they have now, but this is just a product I was using, and I got great results with it. So I know it increases your calcium, and it also adds some iodine that you replenish in your aquarium naturally. And your inverts can't even molt. Your shrimp will not be able to shed their skin if they do not have the correct amounts of iodine in the water. So bringing that to mind, I wanted to do a new segment on torture tests and actually start taking aquariums and have a standalone system, maybe like a 10 gallon nano or something, and start bringing up the calcium levels, bringing up the alkalinity levels one at a time, and then the magnesium, just to see how what type of coral reacts to that type of stress and see how we can shock it. That way we can tell the you guys better on, better if something happens in your tank, how to dissect and diagnose the tissue and, and what's going on, what did you do recently to change it. So I want to help educate you guys better on your systems. Now I've been doing this for so long, so now I'm probably biased on certain techniques and there's so many new things out there now that your feedback really helps me learn quicker too and then I go read some, research something after you told me, hey, this is a great product. So it's almost impossible for me to keep up on everything just because it's such a wide range of information. And most of my tanks are big tanks. I really don't have a lot of nano aquariums. So in a smaller system, your levels tend to change and alter a lot quicker than they do in a big system with more water. Especially when you're cramming corals in a tank and your coral to water ratio is changing rather quickly. So I want to help educate you guys as best I can. Your feedback is crucial to this. So as always, we thank you for being a part of our reefing community. And happy reefing. Until next time.